This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Vanessa Villaforte with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. Douglas County Commissioners honored several community members who have recently died. The entire Board of Commissioners passed a resolution honoring the life and contributions of political icon Brad Ashford. It comes a week after Ashford's death after a battle with brain cancer. Celebrations for Nebraska-born Arbor Day are back after taking a break due to the pandemic. OPPD helped 1,300 elementary students learn about the importance of trees and pollinators at Loritzen Gardens on Tuesday. Officials taught the kids how to make seed balls with wildflower seeds, which create habitats for butterflies and bees. They also planted trees and learned about what trees need to grow. And on 3 News Now, meteorologist Chris Swaim, upper 40s overnight, mainly clear, not as cold. Winds to thank for the warm up. From starting to near 50 degrees early Wednesday mornings, much warmer than the upper 20s we had Tuesday morning. High temperatures respond, riding winds out of the south. We get back into the mid 70s. A little tough to enjoy, though. It's not bad, but know that it will be breezy and certainly more cloudy than where we were on Tuesday. Shaped up to be so nice. 70 degrees on Thursday, spotty rain chances over the next couple of days, maybe a storm in there, but Friday is really the main player here. It's a cold front that moves through another slow moving weather maker that's with us Friday, Saturday morning, lingering into parts of Sunday, breezy conditions through the early part of the weekend, high temperatures holding in the mid 60s, cloud cover through next week and into next Tuesday with highs in the mid 60s.